A WJZ exclusive tonight. We were the only station to speak with Towson University's president after a very tense forum with students in the wake of two sexual assault cases right on campus. It is news that has certainly put students on edge. And WJZ is live tonight. Ava Joy Burnett with what the president has to say after students confronted her administration. Ava Joy. Well, a university official told me that there are about 300 students in that room earlier tonight. Cameras were not allowed inside, but some of the students told me they left feeling even more unsafe than when they went in. Tense. It was really tense. In a closed door session, Towson University students demanded answers from school leaders after a student was accused of raping another student in a residence hall last month. After the meeting, some students told us the answers weren't good enough. It seemed like they weren't actually really, you know, taking the steps necessary to make us feel safe on campus. It was a lot of just the same thing of like, you know, call the police, download this app, but I don't think that's an adequate answer. That suspect, known to his friends in Anyekigwilu, is being held without bond. His attorney told WJZ his client is presumed innocent and they intend to defend his case in court. That allegation and a more recent report of another suspect inappropriately touching a female student rattled Towson's campus. Students are now demanding more security and more urgent updates whenever crimes are reported at the university. My name is Abajoy Burnett. I'm a news reporter with WJZ. WJZ was the only station to speak with President Kim Schatzel after she faced opinionated students. I would just say that we wanted to bring the students together to be able to listen to them uh, and to be able to hear what their uh, thoughts and ideas are to make Towson an even better community. A spokesperson said the university is already considering more police patrols and visibility around campus. I just hope they keep us informed to the extent that they're able to. We all want to know that Towson is going to move to make change. And in the most recent case of an alleged assault here on campus, campus police say a suspect has been identified, but no charges have been filed. Live tonight, Avajoy Burnett for WJZ.